Well, I would say that being a student investor is lovely, firstly, <laughs> first of all, because um, you get to meet loads and loads of prospective students and their parents, and they're usually really, really nice people. I think I've developed the attribute of tailoring like information to different people, because students, we're around Drapers, we're around the sports thing, they're just very interested in where the bar is and where the social life is, for some reason. Um, but the parents, they're all about sort of security and everything being safe and where they're going to live and accommodation side of things. And the people actually organising it already know all of that. So you can talk, to, you can tailor your information to different audiences. It's developed um, the attribute of like working both individually and collaboratively, because you know, sure we're out solitary, sort of bringing them around. But what a lot of people don't know is that after it's gone, we sort of do, we sort of do an open day post-mortem. <laughs> We're like, what went well? What could have went better? What was your experience like? Were the labs open? So it's definitely helped us um, work together well as a team, which you know then means that we can work well as individuals. I would say that the third attribute um, that I've managed to develop through it would also be respecting other people's opinions as well, even though it is from ESB as well. I think that's because I'm meeting people outside of the university. I'm not just getting like academic opinions of things. I'm getting the real world. <laughs> they don't they don't speak like um, all the scientific lingo. So I'm getting the real world opinions about scientific issues, which definitely helps me with my academic literature.